Well, hello, welcome to Izzy's Tarot. Thank you for coming to my channel. You could have gone anywhere, but you came to my channel for that. I'm always grateful. Thank you so much. I'm going to do a Virgo love prediction reading for October 16th through October 22nd. Please keep in mind, this is a general read. If it's not your story, it's not your story. Don't try to make it your story. Just take what you can from it and leave the rest. In addition, please know the energy can go either way. It can be your energy, your significant other's energy, or someone else that's in your love space. Please keep that in mind as you watch and as you listen. If you enjoy my reading or if my reading resonates with you, please give me a subscription or a like. I'd be most humbled, honored, and very grateful if you decided to give me a subscription or a like. Thank you in advance if you do. Let's see what's going on with my loyal, kind, loving, sweet Virgos. Show me, spirit guides. What's going on, my Virgos? Let's see, Virgos, what you got going on? Let's see. Show me, spirit guides. The star. Page of Wands. The Fool card. The Chariot. And the Two of Cups. Jeez, what's all this love I got going on in these readings this week? Nothing but love, 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 love. A lot of love here. First and foremost, the star card here is that you've been manifesting, you've been hoping, you've been wishing. This person is your dream come true. I'll, I'll say it, this person, whoever you're with, you asked the universe for them and you got them. This person also is, is fun. He's fun. You learn things with him. You grow with him. You guys do things together. I mean, he's not like, well, he's one of those persons that make you come out of your shell because you want to come out because he's just that kind of dude. He's next to this page of wands lets me know you look, look. You might um, be learning to cook together, maybe a Thai food, sushi, whatever. Whatever you're doing with this person, it is on point because you asked the universe for this person. This is your dream come true. He he pulls you out of your shell. He pull, When I say out of your shell, he makes you want to be a better woman. He makes you want to be good for him, but he also gives the goodness back to you. He gives it back to you. And you know what's interesting? Go for it. Because that fool card is there. You know, in the past, you've been a little bit guarded on who you uh, trust and who you love. But this person, you're going for it. That fool card, you're going for it. You are going for it. In other words, you're going to love him back just the same way he loves you. I see the chariot card that's here as well, which can represent a cancer sun sign. But that chariot card lets me know, putting one foot in front of the other, baby, and you're not turning back. You're not looking back. You're not turning back because this person makes you feel just that doggone good. This person is there for you. He's a good dude. It is someone that you have wanted for quite some time. And I think that the universe finally brought it. Now, the star card can also represent an Aquarius sun sign. The chariot can represent a cancer. But it can be anyone. But look at this part here. This two of cups. Not only do you guys, um, you see how you're looking at each other? How th these two people are looking at each other? It's that kind of, of relationship that you got going on. Whomever I'm reading for right now, it's that kind of love that you got going on right now. Um, it is the kind of love that you guys are on the same page. You think alike. You love alike. You know, there's uh, you can't keep your hands off each other when you're together. There's just nothing but love here with you and this person. Not only that, I mean, I just think you and this person is just, you know, he's not only, and what, let me say this to you. He's not one of those... I'm going to be very honest with you and just, just kind of tell you what I kind of see. He can be a little bit of a thug too and a little bit of a thug love. And I'm just going to say that because see this page of wands is about a person who takes risks. This is a person that likes to do things. He takes risks. He's not one that wants someone, you know, it's just easy going. He got a little bit of thug love into him. And I see that. I'm just saying the universe, I just see that. And I, and I think that this is someone different than like you've had before. That's why I'm telling you to take the risk, and you, you're taking the risk. That fool card lets me know you're taking the risk, honey. You're going for it. You and this person are on, are on point. And like I said, you can't keep your hands off each other either with that two of cups. You love on each other. You got the same ideals, the same mindset. You walk hand in hand. This is someone that you're in love with. They're in love with you, and all is well. All is well. Now, give me three to five minutes because I'm going to clarify the read. To see what additional information the spirit guides are going to tell me about you and this person. 
what additional information do the spirit guides want to tell me so sit back relax give me three to five minutes let me clarify the reading and just see what additional information the spirit guides want you to know about this person or this relationship i guess i should say what do the spirit guides want you to know show me the star card why is the star card here show me spirit guides sit back relax just give me three to five here i go why is the star card here show me spirit guides Oh, I see the Seven of Swords. Now, I'm going to tell you this Seven of Swords here, this is not for your, your new relationship. This is for your past relationship. You've been guarded, as I told you in the past. You've been cheated on. You've been betrayed. But this person's not doing that to you. This person's not doing that to you. And see, the star card lets me know that you asked the universe. You asked um, the universe to bring you someone that doesn't do you like this, that doesn't betray you, that is not so you can let your guard down in love. And this means this is in the past. That's in the past because you manifested that out of your life because you brought this new person and this person that loves you. That person, whoever your past loves have been, they've betrayed you, they've cheated on you. This is not that person. This is definitely not that person. So let's see, why is this page of wands here? Show me, spirit guides. Why is the page of wands here? Show me. Oh, look at that knight of cups. Oh, he's no joke. He's a smooth talk. He knows what to say to you, how to say it, how to love on you. He's offering you his cup of love. You see the cup of love that he has? Look at that. That's all of his love, and they're giving it to you and saying, come on, babe. Come on. This is, this is your dude. You can let your guard down. You can be who you want to be. He brings you out of your shell. He is your dude. He's off. He's a knight of cups. He has all the love that you ever need and ever want within this cup. And he's saying that he can give it all to you. Whatever your needs are, he's got it. And you know that. That's why you're letting your guard down. That's why this is a special kind of love. That's why you're taking the risk with him, with that fool card here. Let's see. Why is the fool card here? Show me spirit, guys. Why is the fool card here for my Virgo? Remember, this person is to a little bit of a, I'm just being, what, telling you what I see. He got a, he's a little bit of a thug too. He might grab you. I mean, hey, I'm just saying, you know, it's nothing wrong with that. It's nothing wrong with that. He just, he's not just your normal everyday type of lover. He's not. <laughs> no, he's not. So let's see why the fool card is here. Why are you taking this risk? Show me spirit guys. Why is the fool card here? Oh, seven of wands, the seven of wands. You don't have to explain to anybody why you're taking a risk. You got the right to do what you want to do. You got the right to love on whoever you want to, whoever you want to love on. You're standing up for yourself when it comes to this love because it is different. Like, and I told you, this dude is, he's got a little bit of thug loving to him. Hey, he's, he's a little bit of a thug. He, um, in a, in a, not a bad way. Nothing wrong with being a thug. Nothing wrong with being a bad boy. He got a little bit of that bad boy to him. That's what I see. A little bit of that bad boy. People are questioning you. You don't care because you're taking the risk. You're standing up for yourself. Whoever asks you, it's none of their business. Are you happy? If you're happy, hey, I'm ecstatic. I'm happy for you. So you're standing up for yourself for this part with this person. So let's see why the chariot card is here. Show me spirit guides. He's not like your normal lover, though. He's not. He's not like your normal love. So let's, and that's a good thing. So show me why the chariot card is here. Show me spirit, guys. Oh, look at this. You're winning. Look at that six of wands. Look at the six of wands. People are just jealous of you because they know you're winning. You're winning with this dude. They've never seen you happier than, how, than you are now. You are winning with this dude, and he's not like Mr. And like I said, he's so different than what you've normally had. And you, you gave him a chance and you're winning. You're winning. Now let's see why this Two of Cups is here. Show me spirit, guys. Why is this Two of Cups here? Show me spirit, guys. Why is the Two of Cups here for my Virgos? Let's see. I got the Two of Swords. I got the Two of Swords. Stop it, Virgo. Stop it. Stop it. it, it it's good for you. That two of swords means you're being indecisive right now. You're indecisive just because people will be in your ear. People will try to move you away from what you deserve. Do not listen. This two of cups is here. He's on the same page as you. Just because he might look a little different, his head, he might wear locks in his hair, whatever. It doesn't matter because he loves you. He gives you what you want and what you need. Don't listen to what other people tell you. This two of cups here lets me know that. He has the same morals, the same mindset. He might have been in trouble before. Hey, could have been that too. So what? 
so what? He's good and he's he's oh he's he's showing up and he's doing a good job now. He's a good man. He's a good man. Let's start at the beginning here with the star card. Can't be an Aquarius sun sign, but this is something that you hoped and manifested because after all the people that have betrayed you and cheated on you, all the past relationships where you thought they were all that, hmm, here comes this this a little bit of a bad boy, this thug loving comes in. And here's his page of wands. He's a page of wands because guess what? He likes to do things. He's exciting. Um, whether it's taking sushi, sky, skydiving, scuba diving, whatever it's doing, whether it's going out of the country, he's down for it. Here's that Knight of Cups there. He's offering you his love too. That Knight of Cups, he knows what to say, how to love on you. And he's letting you know, I got everything you need. I may not look with the suit and everything that, you know, all the other men that you've had, but I'm different. I bring something different to you. But most of all, I bring my love to you. Here you're taking this risk and here you are having to defend yourself because people are questioning you. So what? So what, Virgo? Let them question you. You deal, you, you're happy. Because here's this chariot card. And this chariot card is moving forward. Look, you see how the chariot card is looking at the fool card? You're taking the risk. You're not looking back. You're taking the risk with someone that's different than what you've normally had. You had to defend it, but it doesn't matter because you're winning with that six of wands. You're winning. You are so happy. You are in love. And here's this two of cups, and it's over the two of swords, which leads me to believe you're a little uh, indecisive because you know why? You're indecisive because he's different than what you've normally had, and you listen to other people. However, it's not going to matter because here's this two of cups. You know that he has the same mindset that you've had. Yeah, he may have been in some trouble before. He might have, hey, might have had to go away on vacations uh, before, so it doesn't matter. He's changed. He loves you. He, he's showing up to work. He's a good man. You have fun with him. This is, this is, hey, this is the beginning of an awesome love affair. You hold hands with him. You guys can't keep your hands off of each other. What? I wouldn't care what anyone else says, and I don't think you're going to care either because he has the same, he has good morals, good goals. He has dreams as well. He wants to do things as well. This is a good, good relationship for you. This is a good relationship for you. Remember, you asked for it with this star card as well. But the star card also can uh, represent an Aquarius sun sign. Let's see on the board who I have. I have, the, I have a Cancer on the board and I have a, an Aquarius on the board. I don't know who this person is. Those are just the two signs that I have that I see on the board that they could be. So, give me three. Let me see. Let me see what my oracles have to say. Show me oracles. What do you have to say? What do you have to say? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. They say, holy love. I don't think I've ever pulled that card. And it also, also, which is which is really good because you asked for this love. You manifested this love. This is your dream come true. It says, you know, things don't always look exactly like you think they should look. But this says, ask and receive. And you asked for it. And the universe brought it to you. And you are receiving it. This is your person. You are in love and happy. Doesn't always look like you think it's going to look, but this person's your person and you gave them a chance. And your heart is and your mind is tied up.